Huh, it turns out I need pearl sand to build pearl stone bricks. So might as well take a pause here to show what I did with the other mudroom here. So, and I also changed a bit, uh, a few things over here. The doors, uh, the door leading to the elevator is now living wood and the back door is dungeon door. Otherwise, this side is uh, the same over here. We got a banquet table with two chairs, uh, <coughs> dishes, a uh, clay pot with a moon glow growing in it. And then the lanterns and banners are the same as on the left side, but then we have a sofa and a zebra. Uh, what's it called? The skin, of course, of course. Massive zebra skin hanging up there, and then the next room has a grandfather clock, a treasure map that I got from fishing quest, and then two graves below it. Well, I thought they fit nicely because they have like stuff growing from them. And we have a dresser with the two books and a chalice on it, and a bed in the corner. And the grass uh, hasn't spread all around yet, but otherwise it's the same uh, wall structure than on the left. But now I need some pearl sand, and uh, I looked at the map, and come on, move. Why can't, why can't I not move? Oh, it's gonna be this map, the one that I can move. It looks like uh, the halo has already spread all the way over here, it's pretty damn quick. So let's get over there and get some sand. And bring some bombs with me to get it quicker even though I have the super fast legendary adamantite uh, pickaxe bombs should be in here take all hundred of them I don't have all my uh, weapons and stuff with me maybe I should take a few and let them in uh, this one Mile Thorn uh, Anchor goes there, repeater over there. Laser rifle, I guess I'll take it too. Switch some of these around and we should be good to go. Close the door. Wait a minute, wait a minute, let's check out over here if the corruption has spread. Doesn't look like it has. Except over there, but uh, the wood here has blocked it somehow. That's good news. Oh, corruption key mold, holy moly. Let's go back and ask Carly what I can do with that, or whatever his name is nowadays. <laughs> Keeps changing because I kill him so often. I can probably make a um, key out of that to open a chest in the dungeon. But what else do I need? <laughs> Temple key, uh, that's probably from the, uh, what's it called, uh, lizard temple, and then I need a bunch of souls. The sight might add fright, these are from all the three mechanical bosses. But anyway, let's put it away for safekeeping. Uh, maybe in this one, summoning items. Let's also check out how far it has spread on this side, the corruption. Doesn't spread at all, at least uh, above ground. Which is weird, because I think it should be able to spread through dirt underground. I'm not entirely sure about that though. <laughs> Look at those flower things hitting. Enemies left and right. Can't really see how much it has spread down there. Bum, bum. Kill the possessed one. Give me something special, nothing. Mechanical eye. Ooh, I can summon the twins if needed. 
But I should probably get like full adamantite armor or something. Or titanium even. Before trying any of the mechanical bosses. Especially Skeletron, that bastard. He's come at me twice already. I dodged him once though, luckily. Here we go, the Hallow Desert. Let's get throw to throwing some bombs and killing mummies, hopefully, so that they would give me the light shard. Speaking of, where's the dark shard? I think I might have left it in the safe. Let's have a look, I might have forgotten to empty it. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in there. Ba bombs, ba bombs, ba bombs, right there. Let's just run across and spam them. There we go. Boom, 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 boom. They didn't really like go uh, all over the place. They ended up in a few holes. There's some money. More bombs, more bombs, more bombs, 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 bombs. There we go. Give me all the sand, pearl sand, yes. Although technically I should have at least some. Maybe I looked in the wrong chest. Oh, there's a light mummy. Kill it, give me your shard. Mm, nothing. Except coins, of course. And now I'm all slow, that bastard hit me. Let's try the... Try the uh, pickaxe, let it go. Oh man, I'm <laughs> drowning in sand. Kill the pixies to get their dust. Freaking flower things flying all over the place. Yes, lots of dust. You know how much do I need? How much do I have? 540. That's probably enough. But let's get more anyway. Let's make it like nice and flat here. Zombie coming in. Don't need to worry about him. He'll die from a few hits of the pickaxe. Uh, did I get any? Whatchamacallit's acorn egg. Don't get those from cacti anyway. Let's go get some over here. And then plant them on the sand to get uh, hallowed uh, palm trees. And I might need more pearl wood anyway for the, uh, for the furniture. Mm, give me a shard. No, but I might be full on stuff. So let's put some stuff away. These two little Acorn shall go right there. Ouch. Oh, yes, Brad, I don't like those things. They're tough and they shoot and... Why not? Luckily it doesn't shoot if you keep hitting it. You won't have a breather to shoot. One acorn. Zero acorns. Zero, come on. This one's gotta give me a single. Let's plant one there and one in the desert. Right there. Although, well, yeah, cactuses will come on their own, but uh, palm trees won't. Most of these acorns aren't grown at all. to plant more. There we go, a couple, where'd they go? There they are, four of them. Let's get out of here. Oh, there's one more. Let's plant it in the desert. Actually, now that I'm here, maybe I should try and contain this. Although, actually, the pyramid is pretty good natural containment thing here. It's like wide enough and it's made of bricks which can't be converted. Bad part is it doesn't go all the way down. I'd have to dig through there and that's something I'll do up at some point. Then again I didn't get a 
Uh, sure, yet so maybe I should stay and kill more mummies. Till they give me one. Come at me, too bad I don't have a water candle. Let's use some of these with the weapon with less knockback. I heard something die away. Let's get the money. Back to the hollow desert. I need more mummies. Light ones, that's a light one, yes. Ha! <laughs> him from above. Damn it, no shard yet. Look at the beautiful background with the whatchamacallit rainbow and everything. More pixie dust, pixie dust, pixie dust. They really should drop more than like two of it. Well, I remember something needs a hundred of it. Rapid fire daggers. And those aren't mummies, they need to be over here where the background is uh, more desert like. Come on, mummies, where you at? I got daggers with your names on it. Mm -hmm. Maybe they only come out at night. Yeah, that must be it. Oh, there's one, so no, it isn't. Chow, 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 chow. Is that a cactus? I think so. It's so tiny. Come on, I need a light charge. Hopefully I don't need like hallowed bars or something to build the Dow of Pal. Which is uh, the thing that needs the light and dark shards. Bum, I'll hit myself with a dagger in the meantime. There's one, another one. Too bad I can't like uh, determine where the b flower thing comes that hits them across the screen. If it, it would be best if it came like. Uh, in the middle, horizontally. There it is, the light shard. Oh yeah, let's kill one anyway. Get the balls out of here. One more acorn to plant. Do -do -do -do. And I am gone. Ouch, <laughs> my own spikes. Let's ask about the light shard. Souls of Night, Souls of Light. Ooh, I actually might have both. So let's whip out the dark shard from here and make it. There you are. I need to go in here. Mob drops. Yes, sir. Although that, there goes most of my souls of night, but let's do it. Actually, I'll first check how much damage it does. Fifty-two. Hell yeah! This is only thirty-six. Where do I need to go? Probably an anvil. And kind of funny that it doesn't require any metals at all. It's made with souls and shards. There she is. Booyah! Oh, it's broken. 36. Wow. Negative 31 damage. Don't think I've ever had that much on a broken thing. And now it's like the same as the anchor. Godly anchor. Let's compare the range. Doesn't have as much. Yeah, this one goes further. Very slow speed. Hopefully, I'll get a.
speed boost on it, parry forging, let's go, Nogs, where you at? That's not it, this one is one gold fist is a boy, yeah, unpleasant. Mm hmm, could be better. Booyah! Ah, broken, come on. Weak, strong, keen, ah, oh, no, I'm losing all my money, hurtful. Shoddy. Hurtful again, broken again, there we go, godly. 59, where'd it go? 50, 50, 59, where is it at? There you are, 59 damage, 90 critical chance, insane knockback, very slow speed, has a chance to confuse, find your inner peace. I probably should get rid of the anchor now. I have so many similar weapons here anyway, these, all these three are pretty much the same type. Hey, we got another traveling merchant. Eladon, what you got? Uh, nothing new, damn it. There's still like one or two items at least that I don't have from these guys, but they keep bringing old stuff like katanas and celestial magnets, although this thing was for two different um, accessories. Maybe I should buy it. Yes, sir, let's take it go ask and then I'm unfortunately gonna have to end the session because it's getting way too late Got an early wake up call tomorrow oh no I didn't want uh, <laughs> to boot the bottle put it back talk to me Joe there uh, yeah the celestial emblem uh, but it needs the Avenger emblem which I wanted to combine with the power glove Hmm, let's ask about the power glove too while we're at it. Yeah, it gives me the mechanical glove. Increased melee knockback, 12% increased damage and melee speed. Hmm, well technically I could do both but then I'd have to defeat the wall flesh so many times to get two Avenger emblems. Oh well, that remains to be seen. So now that's unfortunately gonna be it for the session. Next time I'll build the Pearl Wood Room first thing. And probably something else too, like pumpkin and uh, honey and cactus and uh, glass and whatnot. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.